Hello my friends and welcome back to my YouTube channel or if you are new, hi, hello, welcome for your first time. My name is Kaylee. I hope you are having a wonderful day. I also hope that you stick around and subscribe because that would be really kind. For today's video, we are making a birthday cake for my husband and we're gonna bake it and decorate it and I'm really excited for it. I do need to preface that I am not a baker. I am an amateur. I don't know what I'm doing. I mean, I do. I do know how to make a cake. Um, but like, there's lots of legit bakers on YouTube. So this is just, you know, simple grocery store, not making a cake from scratch. That's what this is. And then we're gonna decorate it like a soccer ball because my husband likes soccer and I thought that that would be easy and also cute. But ironically, we are taking this cake to my in-laws this weekend to celebrate his birthday and it's the Super Bowl. So I'm taking a soccer ball cake to a Super Bowl party. So, you know, it's the original football. It's fun, it's fine. For our cake, we need milk, eggs, butter, and I'm just using a simple cake mix. I am using lemon because my husband loves lemon cake. Um, I also have a lemon frosting for the middle layer, um, and then white frosting to cover it for the soccer ball. And then I have these writing gels, um, black icing, and then a green icing, and we're gonna put some like grass around the soccer ball. We are using a cake mix, however, we are changing it up a little bit, um, cause this says water, vegetable oil, and eggs, but we're using milk instead of water, butter instead of oil, and extra eggs. We're also doubling the amount of oil in butter. So it says half a cup of vegetable oil, and we're using one cup of melted butter, so. That's how we're changing it up. <laughs> I am in my parents' kitchen, which they recently remodeled, which means that I don't know where things are. So I need to figure out where cake pans are. I don't even know if they have the one that I want, <laughs> but it's fine. We'll figure that out together. Um, and I just, I need to find things. So let's go searching in this newly, beautified kitchen that I'm obsessed with. Okay, so I just started the oven. We're baking it at 350, that's what the box says. And then I found these cake pans, which are not exactly what I was wanting. I wanted like a smaller circle and like a bit thicker, but it should work should be fine. So to start out, we're gonna mix the cake mix with the butter and the milk. Now I need to melt the butter, so I'm just gonna stick it in a mug and stick it in the microwave because that's the easiest way for me to do it. So we're gonna melt that and then we'll mix the mix, milk, and butter all together in our bowl. And we're gonna put off mixing the eggs a little bit until the butter has cooled down because it's rare, but if your butter is hot enough, it can cook the eggs and we don't want cooked eggs in our cake. That would not be good. So let's melt this butter. I need to get a mug, which is up there. I can't reach it. Good thing they have a step stool. <laughs> I'm short, okay?
Okay, so we got both the cakes out of the oven. I did the toothpick test. They're all done. We need these to cool down before I can decorate them. So I think I'm gonna stick them in the fridge to speed up that process. For some reason, they smell like German pancakes to me. Shouldn't they smell more lemon? Like, I, I don't know why. It smells like German pancakes to me. <laughs> Who knows? Okay, so I got the cakes out of the fridge and now we need to make sure that they can get out of these pans. I'm a little nervous about that. Um, but first, we're gonna put, I have this cake, uh, What's it called? I don't know. It has a lid that clips on, um, but this is where we're gonna put the cake on. And before we put the actual cake on it, we're gonna put some icing just in the middle so that the cake will stick to it and hopefully not slide around. We're just gonna use the green because that'll be easiest for me. This is gonna work. Um, there is a lot of cake left in this pan, so let's taste it and make sure it tastes good, because if it doesn't, then we're in trouble. It's really good. Oh my gosh, it's, oh, it's so moist and it's, it's so good. I'm excited. Okay, so we're gonna start carving the cake to just make the top a bit more rounded. We're gonna carve it and then we're gonna frost it all with the white and then we will pipe the shape of our soccer ball and fill in some of the black parts and then put some grass around it. So that is the plan. Let's get carving. Let me turn on my music that you don't get to listen to. You get to listen to copyright free music.
Okay, so we did our first layer of frosting. It's like a crumb coat. Um, we're not using fondant, but if you use fondant, you do the crumb coat and then you put the fondant on top. But what we're gonna do is we're gonna freeze, not freeze, stick this in the fridge again. Um, kind of let the frosting get harder. And then we're gonna do another coat of this. Um, so hopefully we can get it to look more clean. Um, it's pretty, it's well spread, um, but you can see like the crumbs of the cake. And that's what we're gonna try and get rid of. So, fridge and then another layer. This is gonna take all day. Lucky. So while my cake is in the fridge, um, I have a post-it note and I'm gonna make the shape of the soccer ball. It's not an octagon, right? I don't know, whatever it is. I'm gonna make the shape so that they can all be equal and I can trace them onto the cake with a toothpick. So, that's what we're gonna do. <laughs> okay, cake is back. It is cooled down. It's not perfect. Again, I, it's 3.30, I need to get home. Um, so we're gonna put this on, smooth it out, and then I cut out a shape, which is not perfect, but it will work. <laughs> and then we're gonna get the soccer ball on there and the grass. So I'm doing so many things with my hands right now. Great. <laughs> Of freaking out because my camera battery is dying. Um, here is the soccer ball. I'm recording on my phone now. Um, but here's the soccer ball. I got it all finished and now we're gonna pipe the grass using the green. So it's just gonna go around it and I'm excited because then I get to cover all the messes that I made around the edge of my cake. Sorry, I never know where to look when I film on my phone. Sorry. Sorry. Um, you guys don't get to see me piping the grass because uh, my phone doesn't have that much memory for that. So I'll show you guys when it's done. Okay, cake is finished. Camera battery is going to die. But here it is, a beautiful soccer ball cake in the grass. Here it is, lovely, lovely. I'm really proud of what I accomplished here. If you enjoyed this video, please give it a like. Please consider subscribing for more. And I will see you in my next video. Bye. Camera battery dying. Happy birthday to you. Happy birthday to you. Happy birthday, dear Christopher. Happy birthday to you. Look, it's sparkly. Okay, what's
It's a charcoal candle. <laughs> 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 All right, who wants cake? <laughs>